Let me turn the corner and talk about something else. Many opponents of Common Core have serious, serious concerns about Common Core's recommended reading list, which contains politically biased and obscene books. It's known as Appendix B, or Common Core's text exemplars. Dr. Bice has removed this list from our course of study. However, removing the list did nothing because these books and their authors are featured and promoted in this very textbook. On page 1095, the featured author is Toni Morrison. She wrote a book called The Bluest Eye. It's a story of an eight-year-old black girl. The book is about rape, incest, and pedophilia. One of the characters is a priest who likes having sex with little girls, and the scenes are graphically described. The depictions are from the perpetrator's point of view. The author wanted the reader to feel as if they were a co-conspirator of the rapist, with the rapist. She describes the pedophilia, rape, and incest as friendly, innocent, and tender, never wrong. You might think I'm over-exaggerating when I say that this book and others like it are vile and inappropriate. So let me read you an edited excerpt, it's only six sentences, from The Bluest Eye. This is recommended for 16 and 17 year olds. It begins on page 162 and 163. Again, these crimes are perpetrated against children. Quote, a bolt of desire ran down his genitals and softened the lips of his anus. He wanted to fuck her tenderly. But the tenderness, excuse me, let me just finish this. This is what you want, this is what they want our students to read. We get the point. I understand what you're doing. If you can leave it with maybe we'll read it, but. Is this appropriate for minors? This is only one of many scenes in the book. I didn't even pick the worst one. We are here today because we want excellent standards. We want exceptional curriculum that is filled with rich literature, not smut, not, pub, pub, not politically biased revisionist history, and not boring government documents. The senators, unfortunately, there's only three, two, three of you on the committee today, you have the power to do something about this. I urge you to pass this bill, protect our children, they deserve better. Thank, Thank you. you.